So the world has engulfed itself in Pokemon Go madness. So I downloaded the app and I thought, let's see what all the big fuss is about. So I've got the app out. Uh, just looking around where to walk in my hometown because it's all over the place. Like there are so many checkpoints and Pokemon I could catch. So let's get walking. So Pokemon Hunt's going well. Currently following the phone as to tell me where to go. I've just found an egg, a Pokemon egg. Uh, no Pokemon just yet. Let's have a look. So I don't know if you can see it, but I've just got a random Eevee. It's popped up on my screen. See, it's crazy to think the amount of people I have seen playing Pokemon Go as I've been walking around. You can tell they are because they're all on their phones and they're stopping at certain points where I've stopped. I had to walk into some bushes to get away from two people that follow me because obviously I didn't want them catching the Pokemon that I wanted to catch. But yeah, so I just caught an Eevee. So I'm now stood in the woods, so I'm going to walk around the woods. I have just put an incense on onto my character, which means for 30 minutes my character releases this sort of incense which attracts Pokemon to come towards me. So that's how I caught my Eevee. So when the game tells you to be aware of your surroundings, make sure you actually are. Because I was almost just hit by a lorry. Because I was in the middle of catching a Spiro. How tragic is that, mate? <laughs> Risking your life for a bastard Spiro. So just behind me is a little place I used to come as a kid with my friends. Um, just on the railway bridge. And we used to be frightened that the railway kids were going to get us. So we used to think they would hide underneath us. So we spend ages coming here all the time. So behind me is now a uh, building site for houses, which used to be an abandoned warehouse where I film one of my videos. So I'm now level 5 and I'm going to head towards my first Pokemon Gym. It's got my first Pokemon Gym battle. Let's go. Okay, so the first Gym battle didn't go so well. I've got my ass kicked. I managed to kill the first Pokemon, but the second one was like triple my top player's stats and I didn't even bother the third one. So it's going to need more training by the looks of things. <sighs> I've just looked on my counting app and I've got 15,000 steps on there. So, more going. I wonder if I can catch this one. Hey, come here. No, come here, come here. So I'm currently just taking a rest in back in my bedroom. Um, just charging my phone so I can get some more juice so I can go back out Pokemon hunting. My friend Lindsay's going to join me this time so when I get in a car I'm going to drive somewhere I can't necessarily walk to. So we've just parked up at Lower Woods Nature Reserve. Go run and jump to get over the map here. <laughs> so where we're walking is like really muddy. And it's really sliding. Like that. And uh, it keeps sliding all over the place. Oh. Oh. Fuck, stop. Say hello, Lindsay. Hi. So, we're walking down the path. Normally, there's maps, apparently, to take so you can follow them. Um, but Lindsay wants to go towards the water. And on the poker map, it says there's water where we're going. Let me just walk down that hill there. And Lindsay can do it. So she's coming through. Oh my God. Some sort of a 
I don't know where you are. Are they seeing us? No. So Pokemon Go still isn't working. That's not at the moment. We literally are just trekking. We're trekking into the woods here. And we have been for the last 20 minutes. And I have no service on my phone. Ninzi's phone's about to die. It's, it's almost dark, so. And we're nowhere near the car. I wanna die. Alright. Don't encourage the murderers. So we just had to cross a log across water because the way we were walking turned out to be a dead end and there was no way around. So instead of walking back, back where we came and then the mud and the hills and stuff. And like 1,000 miles. That one. We decided to cross it. I decided, Lindsay had a choice really, to cross the log on the water and literally just walk in a straight road back to where we came. So, uh, I fell. Turn around. <laughs> Into uh, all that mud. Last Pokemon hunting. See you back in the car. Turn around. So, we're back in the car, on the way home. I'm uh, currently sat in my boxes because of the monstrosity that happens to me when I fall over in the mud. Lindsay's spotless, practically. <laughs> so yeah. So I'm home now, got changed, washed my hands, got the mud off me. Um, thank you for watching this video. I think that's been extremely random and not much to do with Pokemon. Um, I'll post a link to my previous video below so you can watch that. If you like this video, give it a thumbs up, subscribe, and have a comment. Why not? Thank you.